The topic since the end season tournament has been about Zion Williamson's weight. And the fact that, you know, as an overweight person myself, I can see overweight. And he, for damn sure, is overweight. My question to Zion Williamson is, what do you want your career to go like? Every, every player has a ceiling. We've LeBron James has reached his ceiling. However, LeBron James' ceiling is arguably greatest player of all time. Steph Curry has reached his ceiling. However, his ceiling is four-time champion, maybe five-time champion if he wins another one, but greatest shooter of all time. Arguably greatest point guard of all time. Obviously, people's ceilings are different, but every player has a ceiling. Right now, Zion Williamson's ceiling is here. I think that Zion Williamson will never play. If he does not get his weight together, he will never play better than what he's playing right now. Now, I will acknowledge that right now he is a good player. He just scored 36 against the team. I forgot who it was, but this Zion Williamson is good. I'm not going to take that away from him. This Zion Williamson is good. But it goes back to what do you want your ceiling? This Zion Williamson is a top 50, 25 player in the league right now. So if that's what you want, if that's what you want to continue to be, because I don't think with Zion Williamson being with Zion Williamson's weight being where it is, I don't think that he will get much better than this. Now, if he gets his weight under control. Zion Williamson, in my opinion, has the ability. He has skill sets that we've never seen in a, in a player. People talk about how Victor Wimbenyama is a once-in-a-generational player or LeBron James, arguably the greatest of all time, Michael Jordan. Well, Zion Williamson has, has attributes that we've never seen from LeBron, we've never seen from Jordan, Steph Curry, Kareem Abdul-Jabbar, Kobe, none of them. Now, I'm not saying that Zion Wilson would be the greatest player of all time. But what I'm saying is, if he gets his weight under control, which he has not been able to do since Duke, Zion Wilson has a chance to be in that conversation as one of the greatest players ever. Because he has skill sets that we have never seen. And then once he loses weight, if he loses weight, because that's a personal decision, he will unlock more and they would be even better. Stephen A. Smith has gone hard at him or uh, on his weight pause. Uh, so has Shaq. So is Charles Barkley. And I think that they are doing that because they see the potential that Zion Williamson brings and how good he can be. He just hasn't been that good. I mean, he he hasn't been consistent in that way. So my question to Zion is, what do you want your ceiling to be? Because right now, I think you're at your ceiling. Now, it's good. You're still a great player. But if you want your ceiling to be one of the greatest players, you have to get your weight under control. Have to. I look at it like this. A player that we talk about a lot is, you know, Michael Jordan. Well, you know, a player that should have been as good as Michael Jordan, had all the skills, all the attributes as good as Michael Jordan, that we never talk about this in the same breath as Michael Jordan, Vince Carter. And I'm not saying Vince Carter's weight was a problem, but Vince Carter got comfortable at where he was. Vince Carter was supremely talented, but he got comfortable at where he was and with Vince Carter being comfortable what happened he plateaued he hit his ceiling his ceiling was high his ceiling was high as hell but he hit his ceiling 
and he never improved. He never did things to increase his ceiling to the point where now you start getting older in your career and the injuries start coming. Zion Williamson has a shot to it to elevate his ceiling to exponential heights. He just has to get his weight under control. That has to be something that he wants to do. If he doesn't, then he might be Vince Carter. Your ceiling is here, a very high ceiling, but we at, we should have been talking about Vince in a much better light than, and I'm not saying negative light, but in a much higher regard than we usually do. Oh man, you stayed to the end of the video. I appreciate you. If you like what you saw, be sure to hit that subscribe button so you'll never miss any content from your boy. You can also go back and watch past episodes, past clips, and don't forget that the Unpopular Podcast new episodes drop every Wednesday and Saturday. Appreciate you.